my god, that's the video game music. That's the video game music. It's been a hot minute. I feel like I, I see you, but I don't see you on Tuesdays sometimes. Uh, I think you've, uh, I think you've been playing the cat game despite being a fellow person that does not like cats. Yeah, I mean, look, cats are fucking stupid, everyone knows that, but Stray... Holy fuck, you guys. Uh, I was sick for a very long time. Um, you got down with the sickness. I got down with the sickness. The I, have sickness. I, have a, I have opinions about being sick, but maybe we'll save that for another program. Um, but, you know, while uh, the, during the moments where I wasn't like hallucinating and only seeing the color purple, um, I played Stray. Everything looked like a beautiful grape. <laughs> Everything was wine colored for a while. Uh, and I got to admit, I played a lot of roller drum and I played a lot of Stray. Okay. And uh, I, I think Stray is just a really beautiful little package. I finished it the other day with my kid. We played it side by side, you know, after I was sick. And I just got to say, like, what a beautiful experience that whole game was. Um, I'm assuming they captured the nuances and, ma and you know, mannerisms of a cat. Uh, I can only guess. You've I've never, never seen looked at one. one. Uh, yes. Yeah. I've never seen one or touched avoid their gaze. If you look too you long. Say, yeah, yeah, right. The way you guys yeah. talk about it, it does sound like you are both demons who escaped from hell and are afraid the cat's going to drag you back. Because that's yeah. their job. If there's right. one animal that's going to do it, it ain't going to yeah, be absolutely. a fucking turtle. Let me tell you, okay? <laughs> yeah, no, it's yeah, going to be a motherfucking cat. It's going to be yeah. motherfucking... We know uh, this. It's calibers. We're well aware of this. Yeah. Yeah. Kill you for a dollar, cat. Well, cat okay. owners, if, you're, if you're a demon, correct, yeah. I, I agree with right? the chat. Cat owners go touch grass. Cat grass. Cat, cat yeah. owners <laughs> touch cat grass? What? No, cat haters. No. Oh, okay, rats. I thought you said owners. Oh, yeah, it's the cat owners who are the most uh, socialized amongst us. That is true. <laughs> okay, um, okay, we get it. <laughs> so, it's anyway, funny every time. That's why he has to keep saying it. It's so <laughs> funny every time. We're all laughing. It's Where so funny. Where are my dogs at? I am funny. I mean, okay. Same uh, joke here's, here's, forever. Here's my thing. Here's it my turns thing. out that's... What's up? Uh, I'm a big fan of hip-hop and rap music. I feel like you can't get hype you. after like uh, someone meowing on a trap, like or on a track. It's like yeah. you can't go meow, but then like you you hear like a bark in a track. It's like wow, I'm ready to go. <laughs> See, like that yeah. just gets you going. I'm, yeah, that's yeah, all I'm saying. No, for sure. Um, a meow is not a call to action. It is. Uh, listen, you're gonna do shit for mm -hmm. me. Like it's not yeah. like me and the homies are gonna go out and run with the wolf. It's pack. ringing Absolutely. a bell. It's like ringing yeah, a bell yes. for service. It literally is that. Cat, adult cats don't meow to each other. They well, Not really. They only meow at humans because it sounds like babies and it makes us want to like do whatever they want because it's <laughs> geniuses. Sound to go away. Geniuses. Yeah, cat, they, they're um, completely manipulated. They're geniuses. Absolutely. Well, back to the topic at hand and this beautiful little video game uh, starring a complete idiot. Um, no, but it's really good. Holy shit. I, I really loved everything about it. You know, I I think I've seen a lot of praise. I've seen a lot of universal praise mm -hmm. about the cat game. And I think the whole picture is a lot better than the sum of its parts, in my opinion, from a strictly sort of like gameplay uh, point I'm... of view. I just, you know, I don't think there's really a lot going on there under the surface, mm -hmm. but I do think that story, pretty damn compelling. Really appreciate all those robots in that big old can and understanding like what the fuck the fuck happened here like what what happened i enjoyed even though this wasn't like the most cerebral uh, narrative ever told but i enjoy how it was uh uh conveyed and i enjoyed uh how they sort of like uh you know backloaded at the end and you have a nice little resolution to what's going on uh i just enjoyed it i thought it was really cool and i thought it was a really fun sort of like entry level dystopian thing for my kid right it's my kid it's like I don't right. understand. You gotta acclimate him young. You gotta get him used to that now, right? Like, let this be a colorful neon world that is terrible, but also like maybe kind of friendly and and all right. Um, so I thought that was like a an interesting sort of angle where like you know he kept saying he's like, "Damn, where are all the fucking people?" And in the back <laughs> of my mind, I'm like, "Oh, you mean all these like human idiots who just like exterminated themselves over probably the most ridiculous circumstances? You know, you know the way we're headed, like." You know, he didn't need to hear that. He didn't need to Brutal hear that. thing to tell your child. Exactly. He was, I was just like, no, nah, dude, there's just robots now. And that's it's like, that's hey, it. Dylan, can't you remember, pain. you remember watching you know? Cars? That's all the future is now. It's, it's just it. Cars. 
That's right. That's it. That's I'm it. I'm going to introduce you to Nier. Nice. So that's the next step. Yeah. How do you mm-hmm. like robot apocalypses, child? <laughs> Jess, so uh, it, Grub, you, you yeah, check yeah. out uh, Stray at all? Stick with it at all? I played a little bit. I think I'm probably good. I, I don't know. Something about it was like, you know what? I, I might play a little bit more. I got to the point where I got the robot and then they put the little uh, backpack on the cat and the cat laid yeah. on the ground. And I'm like, well, that's just like cats. Like, that's what my yeah. cat did when we moved across the country and we had to put a little harness on him so he can go pee outside or whatever. <laughs> uh, he just is like, what What are you? What the hell is this thing? And I'm like, oh, this is very lifelike. This is very like much like my cat. Um, and that was about what? Like 45-ish minutes. Into yeah, the- it's not long. Yeah. I think we clocked in like 520 oh, was like the total right. run time. And I'm just nice. like, I, I think I'm personally probably okay to not pick it up again. Although I do, the one thing I do like is maybe not so much getting into the story. I don't personally care what happened to the robots all that much. Sure. So I'm like, maybe uh, poking around that world and exploring. It's not really a platformer. Not really. Like, yeah, you um you do jump on stuff, but it's all like sort of context. Like you can yeah. only jump on the places that you can jump on. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And so, and it only let you even like initiate that jump if you were in that context sensitive spot. But that's not really a complaint. I think that's the right way to do this game. And it's kind of interesting. I like the thought of maybe going back and exploring that game where I'd be like, I'm just going to look around as a cat and be like, can I get into that place? And if the game lets me in, I'm, that that's cool. That's probably what I'll go back for. Uh, I got it running pretty well on the Steam Deck. I will probably boot it up again there on there now okay. that I've started thinking about it a little bit more. But it's just... Uh, it's not winning me over like it has so many people. I think because it's so short, though, I probably will give that second chance and see if it does. Okay. I think th- for me, that's the thing is like the the total length of time this game like borrows is right. just right uh, anymore. And I feel like I probably would not have seen it all the way through. Uh, I knew it was relatively short, so I was like, all right. And I agree. Like the the moment to moment sort of gameplay, it's it's really nothing to go uh, wild over. Uh, even the puzzles are just super kind of pedestrian. Right. And again, it's 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 not winning you over with that. With with me, it's the sort of full package that I think um, you know won me over. And and it looks great. It happens to look really really yeah. cool. And I think there's a couple moments in that game that um, fidelity wise, visually wise, kind of tell a, a nice you know, little story there. So, so for, for me, for my money, that, that was worth the, uh, you know, the, the price of admission there, but, uh, but I'm with you, Grub. It's, uh, it's not the most engaging thing. I, I, just, I guess I'm just surprised that so many people seem to be where you're at. And that's not like, Oh, I didn't think that game would get there. It's just like, Oh, it must just really, there must be something a little bit magical happening here as people finish it. you probably, it probably is the right amount of time. It's probably, uh, like, it's not bad in any way, right? It's probably, like, doing a bunch of things pretty good, and some stuff it's really good, right? Is that kind of yeah. how you would describe it? Yeah, it's it's super simple. It's, like, very... Look, it's pedestrian, right? Like, you are just kind of, like, getting through this interactive thing. Um, right. So, uh, you know, I think... You know, I, I, I could understand the, the want for maybe something more on that end of it, yeah. I, I hear there's a Garfield mod. Yes, I've yes. seen that. Is that, is that the there something is. more you've been looking for? <laughs> I haven't played it yet. I'm looking forward to it. I just have not gotten around to it. Okay. I've been watching uh, over my semi-husband's shoulder. He's been playing a lot of Triangle Strategy and um, Live Alive. So I'm getting a little osmosis of, of that. Oh, my god! Because he's way into that. <clears throat> you're, you're, you're way into it. I'm way too into it. Uh, two games this week have pulled me away from uh, Live Alive, Live Alive, uh, Live Laugh Love. 